there is a house in New Orleans. They call it the rising sun. Hello everyone, it's tea time. How's it going? I've pretty much collected everything now. It's it's all mine. I own all of it. So we've seen the lady outfit. Special outfit, that is. We've seen the Sassino outfit. What does the new slave outfit look like? Oh, it's just the Chichen Itza disguise. Which the only real difference between Is there a difference? The belt slightly different. The that's is that it. No, the belt's not even really different. Wrapping on both arms. No, that's that's pretty much the same too. I don't. Okay. Her pose is different. That's not a difference in the outfit though, is it? <laughs> oh hey, look. Look at all my money that's just come in. So I've got the fan on because it's unreasonably hot today. Um, I'm still wearing a hat because I'm committed to this whole hat thing that I do. Um, other than that, actually, you know what? Let's see what weapons I can buy. Uh, bonk. So I've got like the sugar cane small weapon equipped because there's a trophy for killing like five enemies within 15 seconds using it. So if I get into a situation involving the weapon, I will certainly use it. Uh, sure, I'll grab that. Ooh, I lose a chain kill target on that. I lose a chain kill target on anything that's considered heavy. Oh, one thing I don't have yet is the, uh, all the, um, pocket watches. I suppose I could probably go grab them. I'll save my money. Uh, I've still got a few ships going and doing their thing, so I will save my money and, um, grab the pocket watches when my ships arrive. Because once you get all the pocket watches, I think you unlock a new gun new pistol, so I will do that. Um, by collecting everything, it unlocks like this smuggler thingy that I've marked on the map. So we're gonna go see what it is. I think it's like a side mission it's in New Orleans for some reason. Those smuggler thingies are usually not. So let's go investigate. How's everyone doing today? How did ev how was everyone Saturday? Which is a weird thing for me to say because you know I'm usually streaming on Saturday. God, nearly didn't reach that. Mm. Why is there never a way over?
What's up, Kisuka? How are you feeling today? Any better? I'm Catwoman. Isn't it weird how the female character always has the whip? Just throwing that out there. You right so far? Got a cat in your lap? That always helps. God, see ya. Wow, that went up quite a bit. I don't want to be notorious. Don't look at me. Oh, what? A ship I sent out was only going to get me a thousand? Someone fire that crew. Fire the crew of the ship, sell the ship, use the money to buy a better crew and a better ship. Or better yet, don't fire the crew. Break the ship down into its individual planks and then beat the crew with the planks of wood that the ship used to be made of. They're like, I was only following orders! My orders are dumb! Question me! supposed to do? Are you questioning me? Mm. Huh. Ah, there we go. Okay. Locate Macandal's secret stash. Is it in the big green circle on the map, maybe? Not very secret, is it? Is it in here? It's in here. Where'd it go? Ah. Oh. Yay! Just 5,000, huh? Okay. Whatever, man. Why am I bothering to climb? Straight. I'm the smuggler. Uh. 
Hey, Googsy. Mark magistrates on the map. Or do I have to go find them? Ah, there's one there. How convenient. How's liberation going? Uh, not too bad. I think we're nearing the end. And how am I doing? I'm doing well. I'm kind of tired, but I'm doing well. It's warm as fuck as well. And I don't like warm. <laughs> I don't like sand either. <laughs> Is it coarse and rough and irritating? I find it gets everywhere. <laughs> hey, Clutch. Hmm. Clutch, I had a genius idea today. <laughs> You've had never heard of this Assassin's Creed? It was on the Vita originally. The PS Vita. Yeah, you should uh, rename your YouTube to Clutch's Clips and just upload compilations <laughs> of, all, of everything you clip on Twitch. Clutches clip compilation. Because you're probably the most frequent clipper in my chat, in my uh, streams. Clips with a P, not with a T. Holy hell, these are expensive. You totally forgot you even had a YouTube channel? You think the only thing there is the Ice Bucket Challenge? I never did the Ice Bucket Challenge. Because I'm not a sheep. But you love the idea? Fucking do it. Assuming you know how to edit videos. Make compilations and stuff. You didn't really get the point of doing that since you live in Finland. Well, it's just most people who did it never actually donated, so... The whole point was that you do it, you donate, and then you nominate someone else to do it. But people were like, oh my god, everyone else is doing it, so I'm doing it too. Although the reconstruction of our network has required an investment of several years, the help of our American friends means we can now reach further than before. One of our newest informants sends word of a loyalist in New York who might... Oh shit, we're going to New pressure, York. ...unmask the company man. Please, go to Give New York Give away your precious monies, your hell no. Connor. I have enlisted his help in locating Officer Davidson of Lord Dunmore's Connor. Ethiopian Regiment. Charity, fuck no. Dude, donate to the charity that is me. Oh, Jesus. What is this? Aveline paid a heavy price for killing Vasquez, whom she learned was not the elusive company man. Unable to be with her father in his dying hours, she begins to doubt her course of action. Her loyalty to the Brotherhood falters. Spoken like a true capitalist. Thanks, man. Gonna continue the sub next month when the financial situation gets better. No worries, dude. It's not a requirement. 
Also, guess what doesn't work today? That's right, the stream boss. It never fucking works. I don't know why I bother. It's Connor! Connor? I'm Aveline de Grand Prix, your brother from New Orleans. Yes. Achilles told me you would come. I seek a loyalist. Oh, this is before the Officer end of three, Davidson, then. Of Lord Dunmore's Ethiopian regiment. That regiment passed through here. Look at the destruction they left. Their trail leads this way. We will follow them carefully. Over there, through the trees. A trap. Keep after the sentry. I will hold off these men. Go nuts, Connor. Hey, I got money. Wow, dude, you are not fast. Unhand me! One chance to keep your life. Where is Davidson? Who? Come on, time's up. He's in the fort. That was easy. Not for fort's Why sake. Why is it you call yourselves loyalists again? Easier to be loyal in the safety of the fort than out in the snow with a knife to your neck. Run home, now. And don't let me see you again. You won't be able to run then. Yes, ma'am. To the fort! For fort's sake. So many times we I can climb. use that. You know, it's not necessary, but you'd just like to support the streams if, if you can't catch them as often as you'd like due to my new schedule. Yeah. Well, my new schedule is based a lot on the fact that you wouldn't be streaming as often. Definitely working out for me, so you're happy for me. Eh. I don't think there's been much of a difference due to the uh, time that I stream. I do kind of prefer streaming during the day, though. Oh, shit. Stop! Send help! Connor, send help! It's this way. <laughs> Oh dear. You both missed. You suck. Oh, hey dude. Die, villain. Can't I even loot this chest? You think there are a few new people here? Yeah, there are a few. I like to think that's more down to my... ...magnetic personality. Okay. Die, villain! Kisuka, you're not new. You've been here for a while. Definitely the personality thing. Thanks, man. Oh, this is gonna fall. Look at it. Can you get across? No. It's gonna fall out from under me. Look at the f 
fucking thing. I assume I'm going across first because I have a whip. But now I'm thinking that might have nothing to do with it. It might just be them going, Connor sucks! No, it's because I have a whip. Whee! You just stood up to get a drink and you had to sit down in your chair again and blacked out for a sec. Having low blood pressure is incredibly annoying. Uh, get more blood. Can you get across what kind of Jesus do you think I am? Preferably the same blood type. Nah, get a different blood type. Just take anyone's blood. There's plenty going around. Can you find a way in? I will go around and divert attention. Okay, bye, Connor. Have fun in Assassin's Creed 3. You just start sucking the first stranger you see. Whoa there. The first person's neck. <laughs> Whoa there. Whoa. Whew, this got... I fell off the tree. This just became a whole different kind of stream. Just gonna go back and find a tree that I can back can get back onto. You hate yourself? Why? You about to go and buy a litter box for the cat? I didn't know you had a cat. Why is this all just combat? Hi. You both missed. You ever consider that you suck? You don't yet? Oh. I see now. Nice. Bonk. Oh my goodness. This is just combat everywhere. Right, all of you come here with me. Hi. Now. Allow me to access my weapons, so that I can get the sugarcane machete out. Balls. Oh, I don't think I'm getting this trophy. I don't have any ammo left. Owie. Wow, I thought this would be an easy place to get the trophy, but it's not. Buy one with a roof gook. Some cats prefer those and she doesn't. And if she doesn't, you can always remove the roof. This is true. Plus, it will prevent them from spreading litter all over the bloody place. Uh, gonna have a second asshole. Thing uh, you were looking for has a nice door thingy as well. You have three litter boxes. It's a night medically. And why do you have three litter boxes? Also, next week you get to do your favorite thing mess with insurances.
gonna figure out if getting an insurance for the cat is, fin is financially reasonable. Oh. You have three cats, thus you need three litter boxes. You should have one more, one litter box more than the amount of cats we can't fit for in, for in your apartment. Eh, my cat goes outside. Aren't you supposed to be dead? I did, after all, hit you with a poison dart. Those normally do the killing thing. Also, let's reload my sh uh, pistol. Son, if you would kindly pay me the respect my rock commands now. Fighting for the British? And working for my enemy who would enslave you? I'll say something's rank. Ha! The loyalists have guaranteed my freedom. I will fight for it and win it for myself. Meanwhile, the slaves and the poor are targets in New Orleans, and you play the hero in New York. Who do you serve? And do you really think yourself free? Charity should begin at himself, Miss Avelina. Oh. Alright, dude. Okay. You tried. Oh. He's alive! It's a miracle! Oops. Shoot the barrels! I feel like the explosion should have been somewhat larger than that. <sighs> I had hoped it would not come to this. Now, in death, Eternal freedom. You mock me. I chose my destiny. That is real freedom. Perhaps one day you will know it too. I... Who is the company man? <laughs> the answer has been in your own backyard all along. Just open your eyes. What do we think? Adoptive mother or real mother? One of those has got to be the company man. Did you find what you sought? We. Oui. And much that I didn't. <laughs> you think it's the Reverend? Connor, are you always certain in the means and ways of the Brotherhood? I trust my own hands. Of course. Travel safely. It's the arrival that concerns me. <laughs> then you are on the right path. Bye, Connor. Holy money. 
be able to get cover for everything except pre existing medical condition. Oh, right, you're talking about insurance for the kitty cat. George Davidson gave just enough clues to identify the company man. It is with a heavy heart that Abilene returns home. Who the fuck was George? <laughs> I don't remember who George was. Speaking of cats, how's Elsa? Outside enjoying the sun. Kind of annoyed that we were mowing the lawn. She was enjoying the lawn. Now it's gone. <laughs> She's living the good life and we've ruined it. Yeah, she can't hide in the grass anymore. Right over then. You wish you could do that with your dreads. I don't think she's got dreads, I think she's got braids. Because if you look at her when she's in the um, lady persona, that's dreadful. Um, if you look at her in the lady persona, she's got like smooth hair. And I know for a fact that dreads aren't that easy to get rid of. in the cheap seats. No, that's not what you say, mother. You say, shut up, Googsy. That's how we show our affection to him. <laughs> no, 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 not shut the fuck up. Just shut up, Googsy. You, you took it too far. Oh, I've still got one ship going. Uh, where's it going? What's it doing? Do it. It is... Oh, it's not going to add me much. Gonna need to send some more ships out. Tobacco. Tobacco. Oops, wrong one. Uh, no, dread sure as hell ain't easy to get rid of. Took you five hours combing through yours and then you only had a couple here and there. Oh man, I cut mine off. I cut mine off and it was still hell to fucking comb through. You've never felt this welcome. Good, we try our best. afford 40 Tobacco. Right. Make me rich, people. I'm pretty sure her lady persona has non-breeded hair. Yeah. So they're braids, not dreads. Even that doesn't have braided hair. It's smart, you know. Gets it out of the way. I love the, uh... The Connor cameo. <laughs> They're just like, hey, you know how this is set in generally the same time as um, Assassin's Creed 3? Well, here's Connor. I have a ship called Achilles. Nice. You don't name your ships when you get them. They just sort of name themselves. 
So given that we're on the last sequence of the game, sequence 9, mm. it's incredibly likely that we'll finish this before we finish streaming today. So in the event that that happens, I will uh, probably switch over and finish Revelations 2. And by that I mean um, Resident Evil. Also, the game I might play next after um, this game as uh, as my next playthrough is probably Devil <clears throat> Devil May Cry 5 because my brother got it digitally and so I can play it for free and I out of ideas so you know although that won't be for a, a little while yet cuz uh, today I'm streaming this tomorrow I'm streaming Resident Evil and then what are we then it's Tuesday then. Then on Wednesday I'll probably stream Assassin's Creed Odyssey because they got the first episode of Fate of Atlantis out. I should play all the Batman games. I already have. They were fun. I enjoyed them. Yeah. They're all on my YouTube if you want to watch. Arkham Knight on PC. <laughs> <laughs> no, let's not go near that. You haven't seen it start over? I'm, I'm not desperate enough to start replaying games yet. Why doesn't that grand piano sound like a grand piano? Aveline, what a pleasant surprise. I trust you had a safe journey. How did safe. you know I was on a journey? <laughs> what a quaint concept. Aveline? Are you well? You may quit your maternal act, company man. I'm well aware of your true identity. <laughs> oh, Evelyn, do not be so angry. Do you think that I do not know where you go when you climb through your window to the rooftops at night? How you play the dainty daughter to your doting father? How you pretend to blend with slaves of all people? As if you could conceal your true self from me. <laughs> My dear, sweet stepdaughter. A bit you are poorly alive optimized? Because I needed you. Because I still need you. For what? Sit down. About Arkham Knight on PC, you just noticed you have it on Steam and thought, hey, you can stream that after Serious Sam, but then you remember people have been bitching about it, what's the problem? Uh, don't do it. Just don't do it. When he says a bit poorly optimized, he means it may be the worst optimized game on PC. Even after they, like, removed it from the store and fixed it, it's still super broken. Oh. Uh. That guy doesn't have control of his trigger. You have any you want to play and you don't have a console? Well, you can play it, just don't stream it. Then what will be left of your precious brotherhood? At ease. Look at us. So sad. How many years have we worked together for the slaves? You kept them enslaved on your own terms, out of sight for your ill gain. You ended that. As was my intention. Monsieur de Ferrer had different ideas. He perverted my peaceful colony into something ugly. You had to kill him. I owe you gratitude. You wanna? I don't believe you. Get a console. Evelyn, I love you. I raised you as my own. I was unable to bear children, but you brought light to my life. My whole life you lied to me. I am sorry. It was necessary. A mother's duty is to protect. But look at me now in the light of truth. You, who know so well the pain of a life lived in secret, shrouding your power in petticoats and lace, pretending obedience to men who deny you the right to your own abilities. Am I really so strange to you? 
by my bills finding to be crashed into something then it was a solid fire of FPS. The slightest particle effect in the game would just give I up. let the assassins waste your talents. You are too valuable to me. As a tool to manipulate? I know you have been frustrated. Agate, I disobeyed. De Ferrer would still live if he had his way. You see, your aims match mine. You can still play as long as you don't stream at Join the same time, or is it? No, you can probably manage to play it if you don't stream you it. It's just any kind of streaming, and it will just give up. Following confrontation with the company man, Madeline De De Lee, I don't know what that last name is, her beloved stepmother, Adeline finds herself confused and alone. She journeys to the bayou to seek Agate's counsel and test her own faith in the Brotherhood. <laughs> Someone sent <laughs> sent me a picture. Scary movie. Subtitles say loud bang and a deaf person jumps really, really badly. The student returns. Why? What use have you suddenly found for old Agate? I have discovered the identity of the company man. What? Did you not kill him years ago? That was not the company man. <laughs> you ignored my warning, and now you see your error. It was your responsibility to know as much as mine, Agate. I was a child when you brought me into the Brotherhood and made me an assassin. You pretended to protect me, to root out the enemy. And all along, my own stepmother, Madeleine, was the company man. <sighs> Iniquity runs in the family. Try it. You underestimate my power. Agate, stop! Recover your senses. No, it cannot be. What did I do? What happened? I'm confused. Send help. Agate, what have you done to me? The order is the future. <laughs> I win. The look at you, man. I know it well. But you. Oh, balls. Should you, should you get green and white or black and pink litter box for the kitty? Uh, neither. They both sound horrible. Pink is an abomination. Recover your senses. No. Did I just take damage? God damn it. Yep. Because I tried to parry him. The game talk reminds you which. Would I ever do something goofy like Shadow Warrior 2 or Saints Row 4? Agate, stop. Probably not. I senses. lost interest in Saints Row quite a while ago. No. It Did that be. just take damage? What the fuck? I can hmm. Tell me I didn't take damage. You piece of shit. Agate. No, I lost interest in Saints Row after the second one. I wonder if I can throw him. Agate! Stop! Recover your senses! No. Nope. And I've never heard of Shadow Warrior 2. Recover your senses! No. Right. It cannot that be. should do it. No damage was taken there. Okay, we good? Agate! What have you done to me? The order is Oh, you're a piece of shit, aren't you? 
fucking spawning in swinging your sword. What the fuck, dude? Oh, I hate missions like this. Agate! Stop! Recover your senses! No! It cannot be! Agate! What have you done to me? The order is. See you later, Googsy. The future. Try this again. You might be back later, but you can't guarantee anything. It's fine, dude. I, I know it well. But you <laughs> does your conscience attack you? Agate! Stop! That day, when the sailors attacked you. I should not have intervened. I thought you had the spirit of a warrior, like your mother. But you only take after your father, that waxy, pale slave master. Well, wow, that's aggressive of you. Mm. You have no right. Stop right there. Our aims must not be so different. <laughs> do this off stream. It's just tedious to try and do on stream. Fucking hell. I need to reload is what I'm understanding here. Great, except I can't reload when fighting. Why are you countering me? Why are you uncounterable? There we go. A poisonous deception. Nothing more. Oh, are you down here again? Could you fucking spawn when you're actually supposed to then? Jesus Christ. Just open your eyes. Can I not? I can't break your guard? What the fuck am I supposed to do then? Oh, tool kill you, I guess. It doesn't have to be like this. The shards of the Chichen Itza disc. Work with me. Tell me what they are for. I told you never to speak to me of that. The knowledge, it will destroy us all. it we will continue to stumble blindly towards what man I don't miss optional objectives Not in Assassin's Creed games away put it from your mind you're gonna fight me now no mentor okay. do not force my hand the agate who trained me is a man of truth and courage I know he still lives within you. Let him out again. What have I wrought? I should have stayed with your mother. You should have been my child. Raised as a daughter. 
not twisted into this monster. Go now, Agate. Run! And promise never to return. You would bid me a coward's slow, pointless death? As you did Uyoa! I will not live with the dishonor! I... Agate! No! Okay, bye. That mission sucks. Agate's failure as an assassin and his lack of trust in Aveline leaves her completely adrift. She returns to Madeline, ready to embrace her stepmother's cause. Done as you asked. He is dead. And the disc. Do you swear to uphold the principles of our order and all that for which we stand? I do. To never share our secrets nor divulge the true nature of our work? I do. And to do so from now until death? Whatever the cost, I do. Then I welcome you into our arms, sister. Just like that. Together we shall usher in the dawn of a new world. One in which our hands will ensure that all things find their proper place. My daughter, you are one of us now. May the Father Where's of my Understanding fancy ring? guide us. May the Father of Understanding guide us. Where's my fancy ring? Oh. Just like that, huh? Oh, shit. Citizen E, I'm coming for you. No ring for me. Rip. Paco. not going back. I'm confused. No, he's right there. Coming for that ass. Swiggity, swooty. Come in for the booty. She broke it. Uh, it does not work. Why can't I understand? It cannot be. I refuse to believe it. All these wasted years, a lifetime of sacrifice, and we have all the pieces. I am certain of it. Unless it was me, I did it. What did I do? Don't take any damage, are you fucking having a laugh? 
You having a laugh? Oh, I can only chain kill two. Okay. Boom! Okay. There goes my take no damage. Again. Oh, bonk. Break his defense, thank you. Okay, well, this was never going to happen without taking damage, was it? Fuck you, mother! <laughs> it's a me! Why? You can blame Chichen Itza and De Ferrer, but I see through you. My daughter. No. <laughs> daughter? Only two people can call me that. You banished one and sacrificed the other. Foxglove. You killed my father with your care and your tonic. Why? Because he never truly loved you? And Jeanne? My mother? You stole her child, sent her away. You kept her enslaved even after my father had freed her. And now you attempt to return me to that fate. In the service of humanity. In work. The purpose for which you were created. We were created. The highest purpose. I will not serve you. <laughs> There we go. <laughs> That's a bit more of an ending. It's a shame that that was released on Vita first, because that could have been so much better. It was very much restricted by being a remaster of a PS Vita game.
Bada bum, bada bum. Bum, bada bum, bada bum. I can spell. No, I can't apparently. Resident Evil now? Yes, that's the plan. After these credits. So let's just sit and chill and talk to one another. Converse with me, chat. Converse with me on this fine Sunday afternoon. About how the dodo for the record Shadow Warrior 2 is not unlike Resident Evil except the hero Wang is a foul mouth smart ass and the monsters are created by the Yakuza. I'll look into it. But it doesn't sound tremendously interesting to me. <laughs> Especially with a lead called Wang. Um, so the Dodo tweeted out that there are tweeted out like a video of like seven reasons to stop hating pigeons and I'm like but they're rats with wings. They're scavenger birds. Why the fuck did we stop hating them? We only killed that woman because she didn't give us our fancy Templar ring that Charles Lee got when he joined the Templars. See, they chose to have one song in the entirety of their credits. I mean, for a Vita game it was good, but it could have been better if it wasn't a Vita game. I just always thought the story was more important than it actually was. Now I feel deceived. Who knows, maybe I'll play Rogue one day. The, the, the idea of playing a Templar interests me. Mainly because I'm hoping to learn a bit more about Haytham. But the idea of being on a fucking boat again makes me want to blow my brains out. Thanks to Ubisoft, you got Unity for free, but you're hearing less than glowing things. I, I, I enjoyed Unity. It was a bit iffy, because, like, I don't know. There were, there were just moments where it's like the enemies would continue to detect me, like, you know how the bar fills up? That would continue to fill up even for like a second after I got out of their line of sight. So there are a few issues like that, but I think that's mostly at fault of it being, like, tailored to having multiplayer, like the co-op in it. So, but no, I like it. I love the story of Unity. I love the setting of Unity. I love a lot of things about it. I think the, uh, the online is having issues at the moment because so many people are playing it again. With um, it being free at the moment. Well, free on PC.
Bump, bada bump, bada bump. I keep expecting it to break out into the Assassin's Creed 3 theme. Da 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 da. Oh, so I'll be honest, Connor's cameo felt kind of forced. Like, the whole. Oh, yeah, you can find information in New York. Connor's there. It just felt like, why? Why is this George guy in New York? Who even was George? Let's look up George. I feel like he was a character that we met earlier on in the game. But I don't remember him very well. George Davidson. Oh, George was... Uh, okay. He went on a smuggler ship with, um... With Hopton as a sort of bodyguard. Okay, I remember him now. Vaguely. Yeah, Madeline found out about him. Plan went awry, he was discovered by soldiers while George saw a hiding place. Madeline turned to Aveline, her stepdaughter Freyd, and whatever either person's true allegiance, the assassin accepted and helped George escape the city of New Orleans unharmed. Then found temporary safety in the Louisiana Bayou. George was then introduced to Aveline's smuggler allies, Elise and Roussillon. Yeah, I vaguely remember him now. Turn my fan down. Getting a bit chilly. Have you guys seen any of the new Star Wars stuff from the celebration? Like trailers and whatnot. I'm excited to see Ahsoka vs. Maul in Clone Wars. That'd be a good fight. If you don't like Star Wars? Ban her. Ban the traitor! You gonna check it out later? It all looks very good. It's just a shame about Jedi Fallen Order being EA.
Kisuka doesn't like Star Wars. It's treason then. You got Jack of Darth Vader on the back and you uh, that you got from your brother because he grew out of it and where sometimes because it's comfy and forget it has Darth Vader on it so sometimes you get like a thumbs up and whatnot and you're like what? Traitor! Guys I'm going to ban Kisuko. The only way that you can save yourself from being banned is to watch all of the Star Wars films right now. Every single one. All eight of them. In proper order too. Yeah, like Phantom Menace, um, Attack of the Clones, Revenge of the Sith. Except being bad. <clears throat> I am the Senate. It could be worse. It'd take you longer to watch through the entirety of Lord of the Rings. And I mean like the director's editions or whatever they're called. The super long versions. They're like three hours each. I think my favorite part of the entire Lord of the Rings trilogy uh, series, like saga, whatever you bloody call it, is when Aragorn, Legolas and Gimli are looking for the hobbits and they find like those piles of orc bodies and assume that the hobbits are dead and then Aragorn kicks the helmet and falls to his knee knees screaming. That's probably my favourite part because the take they used, the one you see in the movie, the reason he falls to his knees screaming is because he broke his foot kicking the helmet. Yeah, he broke his toe. Yeah. <laughs> and it just seems so authentic. He, they just used it. <laughs> They've done that take so many times trying to get the perfect reaction and the one they use is the one where he breaks his toe. I mean, there's only so many times you can kick a, you know, decent looking prop helmet. Like, that thing's still got to be heavy and kind of thick. I know it's just a prop, but still, there's only so many times you can kick it before it kicks back. My best acting was when I was in serious pain. <laughs> yep, 
You love when they use authentic stuff in movies? Have I seen Django? No, but I know what you're talking about. When he slams his hand on the table and right on top of a glass. And it just like destroys his hand. And he keeps going and rubs the blood on a slave's face. It's fucking great. It always shocked me that it took Leonardo DiCaprio to get an Oscar t so long. That sentence didn't work, I'll try again. It always shocked me that it took Leonardo DiCaprio so long to get an Oscar after stuff like Django where he mutilated his hand by accident and just did not break a character for a second. The funny thing is you saw that movie at the cinema and as soon as it happened you were like, whoa, I think that's real and Googled it immediately after the movie ended and yep, you were right. Yeah, I've never seen the movie. I probably should. But I do know, like, he doesn't even... He doesn't even flinch. Leo should have gotten an Oscar for Gilbert Grape. What the fuck's Gilbert Grape? Gilbert Grape is amazing. That doesn't really describe it very well to me. That's very subjective. Is that like a movie or a character or both or... I mean, The Revenant was great, but I don't think it was his best performance considering he was asleep through the whole fucking movie. Okay, I say asleep. He was unconscious. The guy was attacked by a bear. What more do you want from him? The film follows 24-year-old Gilbert, played by, as in Johnny Depp, a grocery store clerk caring for his morbidly obese mother and his mentally impaired younger brother in a sleepy midwestern town. Huh. Fair enough. I've never heard of it. It's just, The Revenant was like an easy Oscar for him and it was his first one, it just seems really strange to me. It seemed like they were pandering. Again, Revenant was a great movie, but like I said, he was uh, unconscious through the whole fucking thing. I really don't understand this boner that Ubisoft has for putting long ass credits in Assassin's Creed games. Oh, here we go. We found the end. A very low resolution picture of Powered by Adobe Flash. And Havoc. I'm gonna have to watch through Revenant again just to verify that he is unconscious through the whole movie because I don't remember much of it. I just remember he gets mauled by a bear. But then what else is there to remember when that happens in a movie? They're like a, they're like a post-credits cutscene, or it's a loading screen. So there's that. I always love the Assassin's Creed load, loading. You get to just run around in it, and then they removed it, not um, removed it again in Odyssey. And I was like, well, you suck. You keep removing it. And people keep complaining that it's not in your video game anymore. 
so you put it back in the next one and then remove it again and people are like, what the fuck? Do you just forget it to put it in? What the hell's going on? It just seems pointless. Nothing, huh? Okay. I also didn't get the trophy for killing five people with the machete in 15 seconds. It's harder than I thought it would be. Any whom, that is going to be it for Assassin's Creed Liberation. I was about to say for today, but that would be a lie. Um, we're going to move on and try and finish uh, Resident Evil Revelations 2. Maybe even start Resident Evil 6 today. Don't know. Depends on how much time there is. We shall see. I don't know how long the extra episodes are for Revelations 2. But um, if you're watching this on YouTube, the recording will stop here. So if you want to see the rest of what happens today, watch the rest of us out of Revelations 2. And I will see you next time. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.